All right, guys. What up? What up? We are back for another part. Back to the future. The game. Last last time we left off, we got the alcohol. We served the subpoena, and now we get ready to fire up the drill. So, all right, what? Repeat that again, Doc. Ah. Uh... Hey, Matt. Why is there a brace of drunkards gathering on our lawn? Sweet fancy Moses, it's my father. So? So, he doesn't know I'm engaging in acts of scientific exploration in here. He thinks this is where I go to pour through my law books. Oh. You attend to the reaction. I'll try to get rid of him. Attend to the what? Can't we just start over after he's gone? It's too uh, late. Oh, the reaction's man. already started. Don't worry. I'll try to help you out where I can. But... Hey, man! Uh, come I hope this thing doesn't blow up my face. Father! Don't you father me, child! Do you have a release valve on your mouth somewhere? Uh, you don't, release valve. You don't know what it's called. Do you fire, know what uh, I like? Uh, okay, release. Suddenly you are gone. You will have to learn. There is a flame inside me that cannot be quelled by your legalistic gobbledygook, father. Stoke fire flame. Don't get the people don't do that. If you know what calls your mother, maybe I can just get struck by lightning. Would that make you happy? Alright, you want the electricity cranked? Oh. Bing. Excellent. Now twist the valve there. Great. We're about a quarter of the way home. Damn it! Get back here! <laughs> <laughs> You're going to find out. I was eating you, father, but I wish you would go on a diet. I hope someday you have children the bacteria. My fault if I don't get a spark out of laws and statutes. Uh, okay, well, you know who invented fire pop? I don't know either, but you can be damn sure it wasn't a lawyer. <laughs> You're going to find out when you get older. Uh oh. Damn it, man. Listen to the words I'm emphasizing. Don't you turn your back on me. <laughs> You're going to find out. Don't you see this is eating me up inside? Let's do this. Feed it. Some Feed the bacteria. You have children and you will not go at all. I don't Lawyers are nothing but a bunch of hot air. There, I said it. Hot air. Hot air. Fine, I think. Ding. Don't you release me from your unattainable expectations? Uh, well. <laughs> You're going to find out when you get older. <laughs> I don't get to control my life just because you fed and clothed me for uh, 17 years. Oh. I don't I come as a shock to you, Pop, but not everyone wants to be a lawyer. Ah, uh, halfway there. Oh man, do I keep doing it? Damn it! Keep up the good work! If it weren't for scientists, men like you would still be dividing the future with sheep's bladders and goat gizzards! Uh, will it uh, take to light a fire under your unappreciative fine corn? Yes, sir! Don't you go feed the ducks, father! Yes! I could just get struck by lightning. Would that make you happy? Electricity. Just pass a heart attack. Come down, come down. It's all room full of lawyers trapped in a burning building. A good fire, start. Fire. I'll be well, feeding you in that school of yours. You look like a skeleton. Ooh. Damn it! You got lecturing me to be something I'm not. Release valve. Yeah. This isn't food for thought, Pop. It's cruel. Almost there. Damn uh, Coming, father. <laughs> you know, that's another one of your staffers who spins around you like a top. Uh, no idea what kind of pressure I'm under. It's in my head. Oh, maybe your burning passion, father, but it is not mine. Spin. Oh, must you always scatter condescension my way? I don't know who invented fire pop. I don't know either, but you can be damn sure it wasn't a lawyer. Uh, my fault if I don't get a spark out of laws and statutes. Uh, How can I honor your wishes? You treat me like common Jesus. bacteria. 
Why are you always bellowing at me? The bass no. in my head, I'm like Galileo's rotations. Do you ever listen to yourself? Come on, fire. If weren't a scientist, men like you would still be divining the future with sheep's bladders and goat gizzards. The harder you get, the more I know I'm right. You are going to learn, boy. You learn! Oh, I'm afraid we'll have to take this up later, Pop. My Ooh. soup's about to boil over. All right, I didn't think it ended like that. This isn't over, young man. Oh, yeah, Red Bull about something like that. Damn. Are you okay? You and your dad sounded... It was an argument we should have had a long time ago. We... Eureka! Now all we gotta do is fuel up the old rocket power drill and you and, and I can... I can take it and go. But don't you want to test it first? No time. The, uh, the, the last train for DC leaves in just a few minutes. All right. You've got to get this baby to the U.S. Patent Office. Uh, exactly. So tell me, Harry, when can I expect to hear back from the Patent Office? Uh, one week, a month to six weeks. Uh, we'll do a month to six weeks. Oh, in about, I'd say... I, I can't. Huh? Emmett, I I'm not from the patent office. I don't understand. I, I, I lied to you, but I, I didn't want to. It was just, it was the only way I can get you to trust me. See, there's somebody who's in big trouble. Uh, someone very important to me, to, to both of us. Uh, I can't tell you who, but I need to save him tonight. And, and I need your invention to do it. I'll get it back to you, I, I promise. And, Emmett, you're gonna be a great inventor. Wait! That was too easy. Keep the throttle at about eight. Oh, all right. You did right by me. I'm sorry if it sounds like I'm yelling, guys. Let me know if I need to tone it down a bit. Okay, Doc, I got the drill. Now let's get you out of here. Come on, start! supposed to be Doc! They're moving him to another facility for safekeeping. Oh, I better go get a quote from the police chief. Uh, what the papers say? What happened? Fade Paddy in? wagon intercepted. Suspect slain. And they're still after him. You like how that is pop in some people. gonna rescue him now? Paper? Uh, we're gonna get these. We're gonna make hmm. a rocket bike. At least the rocket part came out of this in one piece. What could go wrong, guys? What could possibly go wrong with strapping on a jet engine to a bicycle? Alright, I'm coming, Doc. <laughs> the way that bike looks reminds me of Pee Big Adventure. You guys remember that movie? You ever see that movie? <laughs> Francis takes his bike. Okay, 17 cents for gas. Damn. You're still in danger, 
Doc, we've got to get you out of here. What's that? I said you're still in danger. Never mind, never mind. Get me out of here. I will talk later. Uh, let's go to the right. Maybe the tire iron would get, would get busted. They left! Oh no! Alright, let's try. Let's try the antenna. Not sure what that. Alright, I guess not. Tire iron then? They won't budge! I want to whack that with a tire iron. Okay, okay. No, no. Not sure what that. There we go. Let's see what Doc has to say this time. Can't break the lock. Can't break the lock. There's a key, but it's probably up front. All right. I'll be back. What's he doing here? Alright, we're gonna make this quick, guys. It's gonna go quick. It's gonna go quick. Why on earth would I want to whack that with a oh, tire iron? We're gonna crack the window. Alright, the antenna. No good. The window shut. Break the window. To get pop. Boom. Why on earth would I want to whack that with a tire iron? Cause. Uh, you know Why what? on earth would I want to whack that with a tire iron? All right, we keep doing this. Let's make our way around the other side. Ah. Tire iron on tire. Cap, we got an antenna. What's going on now? Let's go right. Keys, I can't reach them. I need a distraction. I need a distraction. Leave it to me. Hey, driver. No driving too fast. What are you trying to do? What are you trying to do? Kill me? Not quick enough. All right, Doc. Distract one more time. Damn it. No. the side again. Can you distract him again? No problem. Let me see if I just get this window hey, broken driver. out. I demand to know where you're taking it. And how long is it going to be to... We get there. Shut up! I hate to pop out of it. Boop! Alright, 
Doc. One more, one more time. We do it from here. One time for me, Doc. One time. Right, can we get the rear window from here? Yes, we can. There we go. Can you distract him again? this I find the seat distinctly I object to your get it, get it, get it. and I find the seat distinctly uncomfortable you have a bill no I can sit on hey you, I'm talking to you driver don't ignore me you oh, shit oh, oh. <laughs> thanks doc thanks doc I guess that's why they call you the street how did you know that I have my sources Let's get Doc out of here. And keys. Stand back, Doc. Uh oh. Oh no, you don't. I don't think throwing the hubcap at that would do any good. Eat lead, Sagan. Alright, we're gonna throw it. Just like a part three. Ow! Son of a bitch! Uh, let's get the Roscoe. Uh, pop the shackles. sorts of bizarre repercussions my younger self's invention of a flying bicycle will have on the timeline. Because the evidence, none whatsoever. Did you know that would happen? I had a suspicion. I never could keep those rockets from exploding. So, what do we do now? Now we get back to 1986 before our interactions with the past inevitably cascade into a calamitous future. Where'd you leave Einstein? Uh, Doc? He's not in the pound, is he? No, uh, I think we've got bigger problems right now. Great Scott! Alright guys, well that's gonna end episode one. I'll be seeing you guys soon with episode two, so keep hitting that like button. And comments, all that good stuff. And remember to subscribe to be put into the giveaway I'll be doing. Soon enough when I hit that certain mark. Get yourself a nice little gift card. Ah! Uh, what's happening? I don't know. <laughs> we'll have to be careful not to run into ourselves. Hey, fellas. All right, McFly. Let's go see the boss. History says Tanner will be arrested by a rookie cop by the name of Danny Parker. I fear that nothing will save Hill Valley from descending into the fires of chaos and corruption. Nothing is over until Kid Tannen says it's over! Alright guys, there we go. I'll see you in a little bit.